Hey guys, in this video we're gonna say goodbye to April. It's a bit weird that April is already over because that means it is my birthday. Very soon. I think that's a bit scary. I'm gonna turn 22. I'll make sure to vlog my birthday because I won't be at home. So it's probably gonna be a bit of a weird birthday. Um, I'll be working far away from home. I probably won't even get like any presents or birthday cake or anything like that but I'm gonna lock my birthday if any of you want to send me a birthday um, just a small birthday video just wishing me happy birthday you can do so um, and maybe then when I make the vlog I'll put some of you in the end of the video so that your birthday videos will be at the end of my birthday vlog I think that would be an amazing memory from my 22 years birthday and also you can be a part of celebrating me now when I can't be at home and that would just be amazing. So if any of you just make a really short video wishing me happy birthday then you can send it to me on my email, I'll just put it here. Um, that would just be amazing but it's not something you have to do, it, it would just be cool. But let's jump into what this video is really gonna be about my April favorites. So through April I finished my internship on the 14th of February. My internship was over and we went on a weekend getaway. If you haven't seen the vlog, it's a really nice vlog. I'm gonna put a link down below. Something that also happened in April was that Daniel and I bought a car. We bought a car and none of us have driver license but we still bought a car. <laughs> oh, we might sound insane but Daniel's taken his driver license and he was looking at cars just like to be prepared for when he got his driver license and he just fell in love with this car and he knew that if it didn't react really quickly then it would be sold to somebody else. So we bought Ulrich, his name is Ulrich, and it's this small, really ugly <laughs> car, but we just love it so much. Um, and yeah, so we bought a car this month. I think that's a pretty big deal. So, things that I've enjoyed this month. I have a few things that I've really liked this month. First of all, I bought a lot of new plants this month, and this cactus is one of them. Isn't it just lovely? I think so. Um, but also I planted a lot of seeds for the summer. I planted sunflowers. I planted some flowers I don't know the name of in English. And I can't wait for them to bloom at some point. They have grown a lot already. I'll just put in a clip. Um, and yeah, they're amazing. The next thing I want to tell you guys about is this Hippie Pits deodorant. It is um, vegan, aluminium free and cruel, cru cruelty free and it is a really nice product. Um, I've been using it I've been using it for the past one and a half weeks and I think it has done a really good job. I've been playing badminton with it also and I think it, it worked really well. Um, it is this, it kind of feels like a powder, um, a mix between a creamy feel but also a powder and it is super nice and then I just put it on my pits and it's a really really nice product. The smell is great, I put it on like the first day I put it on Daniel was like you smell so good what is that and I was like oh that's probably this one. <laughs> So it is a really nice product and I'm gonna put a link down below if you want to check it out. It is a good alternative to the deodorants you can buy in a normal store. Um, you don't really know what has been put in it. They are probably filled with a lot of chemicals that you know nothing about. And this is just a really nice natural alternative. I also bought a lot of blankets this month or like I bought two. I bought this beautiful green one that I've shown you in the vlog. I hope you watch my vlogs and I've also bought this one that is so colorful and beautiful and I keep it on my bed um, 
and I'm just I'm so happy about them I've been wanting one for so long and this past month I finally decided I would go search for one and these were like really fair prices because sometimes they're extremely expensive which I completely understand because it takes so long to make these but I'm just so happy about them I love them I've also just recently made a thrift haul video from a weekend getaway and I showed you this screen back and I've used it every day since the video. I keep my wallet and sunglasses and keys and stuff in it when I go out. It's my everyday bag and it is just so great. I love the size and I've been loving it so far. And the last thing for new stuff is my beautiful pot which I also found thrifting on a weekend getaway and I just think it's so beautiful I know some will think it's awful but I love it and that is what matters and it's brilliant so I really wanted to talk about youtubers in this video and like give you some new youtubers to watch but I am just always watching the same youtubers um, so if you have any suggestions for me please leave them down below I would love to experience some new youtubers so if you know about someone that are making videos like I do like that have the same interests please leave them down below I would really appreciate it and now for my April playlist so I found this classic song, it is Katie Malua with 9 million bicycles because it suddenly like occurred to me that I haven't heard it for a really really long time so I put it on the list, let's just have a quick listen even though you probably know it We are 12 billion light years from the edge That's a guess mm, This one Johnny Nash, I can see clearly now I can see clearly now the rain is gone. It is such a nice song and it makes me so happy. I just wanted to put it on the playlist. Um, but yeah, there is also some new songs you haven't, maybe you haven't heard before. I've put a song called Foreign Air in the Shadows. So, I'm gonna put my playlist down below and it's called Blooming April. So when it comes to shows and TV and all of that stuff this month I really want to tell you about something I've seen because I've seen it I like I've I've seen a uh, little I've seen I've seen two seasons for the past week. Like I'm addicted to this show. I haven't been watching television at all for the last week or something. I don't really watch a lot of TV TV in general. Um, Daniel and I have been talking about just getting rid of the, like, the TV channels because it's a waste of money. But for the past week I've been watching The Paradise. Like a lot, lot. It is um, like the plot takes place in the 1800 in the UK. And it is about a man who owns a shop called The Paradise. And I don't know, it's uh, of course it's a love story and I've just been loving it. I don't know why. There's something with me. I love old like movies that are taking place in the 1800s. I don't know. There's just something about it. There's something about the way they talk to each other. Um, there's so much grace in them. I don't know. Like, Of course there were a lot of awful things going on back then as well. But the way they interacted with each other and the respect they were. I don't know. There's just something interesting about it because I don't know. It's just such a different time. So, I don't know, it's on Netflix and I'll recommend it if you like the same things as I do um, because I'm watching it so much, it's mad. So I'm almost done, this is the last thing I want to say. It is food and I don't have any like food to mention but I want to mention that I'm gonna go get it. In April I made a morning tradition that every morning when I wake up I fill this with water um, and ice cubes and I drink this and it is the first thing that I do every morning is to drink this whole bottle of water. One thing is that I get hydrated, um, another thing is that it's really good for your skin, um, it's good for like everything, it's a really nice way to like wake up. Um, so 
it's just a tradition that I've started to do and I wanted to share it with you guys and just let you know that if you have a cute bottle that you think is like fun to drink from um, and you put in some ice cubes and make sure that the water is like really cold it's more fun to drink it so I've been doing that and I'm gonna continue doing it because I think it's a really nice it's a really nice thing to do so I hope my throat is always getting like really dry when I make these videos and just talk and talk and talk but it is over now uh, maybe you're just also tired of listening to me ramble but that was it April is over and it is my birthday tomorrow and remember if you wanted to send me your birthday wish video then the email was there before I can put it there again um, but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you soon bye guys